High school swim team in Lafayette is heartbroken tonight after being told that they've been locked out of a key competition because of a missed deadline. As KTV's Henry Lee reports, they feel like they're being unfairly punished. When they were punishing us, the athletes who should be the ones competing in this meet, and this meet's all for us, uh, it's pretty devastating. Kale Hansen is shattered. He and 12 other swimmers at Akalanas High School in Lafayette won't be able to compete in a regional swim meet, one they've been preparing for all season. I definitely thought it would be the big meet where we could all show up and show out and showcase our abilities and everything we worked hard for. This after intense swim meets and practices. Eight of the swimmers who qualified are seniors who are missing out on what would have been their last chance to swim for the Akalanas Dons. I do take proper ownership here. Coach Brett Usinger, a former Akalana swimmer himself, says he tried to submit his team's times before the deadline on Sunday. But he was in Oregon at the time with a bad internet connection and no hotspot. The next day, he was told his team's entries never made it and that his team couldn't take part in the North Coast sectional meet on Friday. But I also think there's something to be learned about potential future practices or improvements to make sure that students who have earned the right to swim get to swim. The team and the principal asked the CIF, the state's governing body of high school athletics, for a second chance. But it's a no-go. The Dons are dead in the water. Our athletes, they performed this year and did everything they were supposed to do, and ultimately they're the ones who are getting punished through this whole process. You know, regardless of fault, it shouldn't fall on their shoulders. I think all of us are just really disappointed that we don't have the opportunity to swim at this meet because we've worked so hard to get to this spot. It's really devastating knowing that whatever the error was that we aren't going to be able to swim even though we like all 13 swimmers are very qualified. CIF says reminders were sent to all schools that the deadline was mandatory and no exceptions would be made. In a statement, Pat Craigshank, the commissioner of athletics, said in part, the procedures and consequences for failing to follow these championship procedures were agreed to by NCS member schools. Akalanas did timely submit entries for its diving team. So for now, the team's holding their heads high. Their plan? Just keep swimming. In Lafayette, Henry Lee, KTVU, Fox Studios.